and welcome to episode 36 of the Magical Animal Club podcast with me, Stampy. You said that wrong. It's not magical, it's magic. Hello and welcome to episode 36 of the oh, Magic Animal Club <laughs> podcast with me, Stampy. And me, Squid Nugget. It's only been two years. Yeah, um, we're, we're every, to be fair, we were literally so, oh, hello everyone, by the way, um, we're back for a maybe one-off, maybe we'll do more, we'll see podcast, but we were just about to start and I was like, what did we say on the intro? We had to like go back and like watch it to be like, what did what did we say when we started these these things? Uh, it is the magic animal, yeah, it's not magical animal, we're not, we're not magical, we're just m- magic. What is the we, difference we do, we between magic, magic and magical? Because like if so, say if two brothers, one was like a you know born a wizard, he had magical powers, and then the other one wasn't a born wizard, but he could read spells. So although he could produce magic, he was not magical. Ah, uh, I feel I feel like you could switch around those words, and it would still it would still make sense. Go on, I then. could say I was born magic. Yeah, and that, I could do I can do English? magic. I was born magic. Would it's not French, that, is it? Would you would you put that in a stampy novel? <laughs> yeah, with, with the quality of my novels, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just repeat that for ages on a page. I was born magic. I was born magic. It's great. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Anyway, welcome uh, back to this world. It's been two years, so I really want to have a look around and see what we did in. 35 episodes um, because yeah I don't know I don't remember any of this I remember some of the stuff like we did kind of carry on the squid and stampy theme throughout we were very I um... remember this chair oh <laughs> remember this chair oh, God, I'm, oh I'm such nostalgia for this chair I'm gonna miss yeah, it you farted like old time <laughs> yeah, that was your farty chair <laughs> the farty chair oh <laughs> give it a sniff oh it's just it hasn't changed <laughs> it, the smell hasn't waned squid <laughs> farty wood hmm I think that's why you had too many sprouts one night. I think that's just oh. the one that you stained a bit. That's why it's a memories. bit more brown than the rest. Windy memories. <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> we, we used to kind of have like a, a soft rule that like... Like, yeah, so for, it used to always be like we'd be chatting and we wouldn't ever talk about what's happening in the gameplay because the idea of the podcast is some people would be only listening to the audio. Uh, this podcast is going to be video only, so I guess we can kind of chat about uh, the world a little bit more. But uh, yeah, basically, considering everything that's going on in the world, uh, we kind of had the idea to... Yeah, hey, what's going like, on? <laughs> I, I don't know. I haven't, I haven't turned on the news in a few months. I have no idea. But um, yeah, because of what's going on, we thought we'd do a, a little bit of a one-off. So we kind of said like yesterday what in terms of what we're going to talk about we don't really want to be talking about the virus uh too much because we want to give a bit of a break about it but saying that but, like it is kind of dominating the world so yeah. you know there's a good chance like it just when we're because we're kind of going to be catching up with each other and what's going on so well, it's affecting I, everyone i thought all right we, we can have a you know general chit chat but i feel like because me and you for the past decade we've pretty much been scythe self-isolating experts so i thought what it might be a good idea to do is provide some tips we're not going to talk about the virus but provide some tips that have got us through working predominantly from home uh i think that'd be pretty helpful do you know what i mean uh, giving uh, things i think that'd be very very helpful yeah we yeah. give uh, we give tips tips for for staying uh, at home yeah <laughs> I, I mean like it's, it, it, it is a bit weird because it's affecting, especially now, like, so we're recording this the day after the UK, like, official lockdown. Yeah. And so it's, it's, it's been a little bit surreal because for me personally, it hasn't actually affected my life too much. But nah. I'm always very wary that, like, you know, I, I'm not like a, a small business owner that's going to be affected, like, monetarily. Like, we're in a very lucky, privileged position that where it's mainly affecting me socially like the the, the hardest thing is that oh, i haven't right. been don't, able to see my family it stops. You know, people well, no, are, like it's people I'm are saying, having a bad time <laughs> i'm not bad i'm saying like i'm not i'm just saying like i'm acknowledging that and yeah, so it's no, very I mean, easy for me to say like oh i've been training for this all my life like oh, yeah. quite, you know like i get to play my video games but you know i'm saying for us you know it's it's a bit different so i'm constantly trying to remind myself that like you know of how this is for other people yeah and one of the one of the, <laughs> the funniest things of yesterday, I was uh, I was I was taking a shower uh, and I had my phone in the shower like you do, and I was like, right, I'll help people out by 
you know, giving them some tips of what the best thing to do, you know, to like try shampoo keep... first, then keep conditioner, you... no, not, that not, sort not, of not tip. shower but... tips. <laughs> oh, oh, sorry. Well, well, well. But that is something that I do want to talk about, right? Shower so... tip? No! Can we no. not talk about shower no. tips? No, let me just go. Let me. Go. So we had a discussion with our friends, right? Do you ever, sh- do you ever wash your legs when you're in the shower? Like, do you ever make a conscious effort to like get like shower gel and wash your legs? Because I've, I don't, and a lot of people don't, and some people that do find it weird that people that don't are weird. So oh, where, where do you stand on the? Do you like you know you wash your hair, you wash everything else? Do you do you go for your legs? Or do you? Just do like, I go you know? for them? Like, <laughs> get at it! <laughs> <laughs> Scrape that grime off! Come on, go! Uh, so if I, ha- I don't often, but if I have a bath, yeah. I'll, I'll I'll do my legs. Shower, <laughs> generally no. I do my legs. <laughs> do you- <laughs> <laughs> la 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 <laughs> like squeeze walks in I'm like kicking my legs up in the air like la 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 clean like a legs. synchronized <laughs> swimming yeah. pool routine <laughs> <laughs> yeah so g- generally I would be like in so the, you're the uh, you're on the you don't wash your legs in the shower kind of guy no no I, I don't I don't does anybody I, else listening find that weird like do you ever find yourself like ignoring your legs like not showing your legs <laughs> do you ever find deserve? yourself ignoring your legs <laughs> Squid! Squid! Not now, shins! Not now! Squid! Squid! I'm tired! Can we sit down? No! Legs! Shut up! I'm ignoring you! <laughs> so yeah, comment down below, alright? Um, if, you, if you're if you on the shower legs crew or no shower legs crew. But anyway, I was in the shower and um, yeah, I thought I'd give people tips on, you know, what the best things to do about self, self-isolation is and how to keep yourself busy and whatnot. And I found myself writing stuff that I never do. <laughs> I was like being really hypocritical. I was like, well, you need to get up early and you need to be in a routine and you need to do some exercise and you need to do some chores and write yourself a list. And I'm like, I'm writing this and I'm like, I don't do it myself. I'm like, but that's always person. the thing with advice. Like we always give people better advice than like what we would give ourselves. Like that's the way to like, if you're dealing with a situation, imagine like a friend has come up to you and they're dealing with it and they ask you for help and like think of the advice you'd give them and follow it because we don't like we don't do that no but we like we know the stuff that would probably make our lives a little bit better but i just i don't know i just kind of ignore it i'm <laughs> too lazy my routine is no routine well oh, go on yeah. then well see as soon as we're on the topic so as i said we've been working from home for what like eight years now seven or eight years we've both been like working from home yeah, well, this... Uh, no, wait, next... Next, I think, June would be 10 years on YouTube for me. Wow. But there was, like, we were... Yeah. During early days of YouTube, we both had, like, other jobs. You were doing, like, kind of gardening, gardening stuff mainly, and I was working in a pub and stuff. So, yeah, um, yeah like, what have you... um. Like, 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 what is, like, I don't know, like, I don't even know what your routine is. Like, what do you, <laughs> what do, you do? <laughs> what do? I? What do I do? Um, so... I don't know, just kind of like any other job. I just get up, you know, take a shower, have some breakfast, and then make myself a hot drink, and then go and start the day, do some work. Um, and then once I've done, I just kind of do other stuff. It's it's really weird. The things that have helped me, if you are still working from home, is definitely setting a dedicated room up to work in. Like, if you're thinking about setting up a desk in your bedroom, if you have to, that's, you know, that's fair enough. But if you can't even find yourself a small little room in your house just try and put a desk there and work in that spot and then when you get to bed you have that mental disconnection between work and this is sleep time sort of thing because a lot of times when you work in the same room as you sleep in it, you find it trouble you find you know it hard disconnecting and and kind of relaxing so um it's definitely important to if you can work in a in a separate room even if it's not a desk job just you know just go somewhere else just work like <laughs> outside if you have to if you're if you if you got a laptop or or whatnot, so yeah, just kind of like that. To be honest, I've just worked for a bit, have a have some lunch, and then I generally generally try and stop by at least like five or six o'clock, and then have downtime. But sort of the the bad thing about doing what we do is that it's a hobby as well. So a lot of people, you know, they'll do other stuff for hobbies, but we kind of you know record all day, play games, and then our downtime is also recording and you know not recording but gaming. So I don't know how you sort of deal with that. Do you play different games to you record on? Because I know obviously you've you took a big step back from Minecraft. Um, yeah, um, sort of thing. So, 
So, like, it's a bit weird now, just because, like, I'm, like, kind of, like, I, I, I hardly do YouTube now, like, as mm. it is. Like, I've, like, one Minecraft series, we do, like, one video a week, and then, like, I've been trying to do live streams, but, um, hold You've up been a story. Having trouble, we, haven't you? Yeah, I've been having trouble with the bots and stuff, so, uh, I, I guess I'll, I'll kind of more talk about what I used to be like when I was kind of, like, full force YouTube. So, for a few years, I was just super unhealthy. I would just work, like, I would overwork. Like, the whole thing about cutting off it whatever time would never happen it would be like i'd be excited about a thing i was doing and i would just keep doing it and like it would be me needing to eat would be the thing that would like force me to to, to <laughs> start you know I, I was awful but that that is the biggest thing i think set, setting off a hard cut off especially if you have a job where like like you would never be able to do it from home anyway just imagine that you've come home and you can now no longer <sighs> <laughs> gg <laughs> <laughs> wait come up here carry on, carry on talking come up here where are you I'm going to the big tree again. Okay. Yeah, so, like, how, the, the hard cut-off is the, the big thing that, like, really changed me. Uh, like it so how did all... you hard cut-off then? What did you... What did you do I, I, I just said, like, I'm game? pretty, like... I'm <laughs> pretty, like, stubborn. Like, if I... If I... Like, I'm I'm very lucky in terms of, like, I'm very good at, like, if I set myself to do, do a thing and say, like, right, I'm never going to do this again. Like, I could just never do it. Like, I know other people are hard at that. But if I just say, right, now I'm just going to not work past this time. I just won't do it. So it's kind of... Like, I I'm just quite good at forcing myself to do stuff. <laughs> like, if I'm scared to do something, I just force myself to do it, and then I'll just do it, and then I'll be like, right, I've done that. So it's... So for, for me, it wasn't, like, um... Uh, wasn't yeah, hard. Too, too hard. No. So, um... Yeah, I mean, like, the the advice that you were kind of... were going to put out, but then realised you didn't follow yourself is probably good ad advice in terms of, like, having a schedule. Uh, also, don't, like, um... One of the things I've really found out is that there'll be a lot of situations, and this has been more so when I've been doing writing rather than YouTube is I'll get to a point where I'll be like right I want to be working for a few hours now and I'll sit down like to to work but then like I'll end up just being like getting distracted or like going on YouTube and stuff but then like I'd keep going back to the work but like not really doing it full force and I've got much better at saying right you know what obviously like my head's not in it just have a break just go do something just go play a video game go out you know walk the dog and then just come back to it like don't if you're working just work if you're working but like you're you're constantly like purposely distracting yourself just like don't even try to work like because you're obviously not in the right mindset and then mm. that way you're like like just, and just don't feel guilty about that like if you just can't work just don't you know wait until you are enthusiastic and you know usually it'll be a case where i'm trying to like start a book and i'm trying to write this chapter and i'm like spending ages doing it and then i'll leave it for a bit and go and do something else and then suddenly i have like a an idea which i wouldn't have thought of otherwise and i'll come back all excited and then i'll write you know three chapters in a day so that's kind yeah. of a, a little a little tip is don't beat yourself up about it like sleep on it yeah it's good to have a cut off point but like you don't have to be the nice thing is is you don't have to be too strict you know on yourself you can be a bit more flexible with your time and you could get as much work done but spend less time working because you know you can only work when you're at your your peak uh, i guess yeah good stuff good so, thumbs up so are we is there anything else we want to add before we drop this corona isolation talk today um... so, to move on everyone don't want to hear about it you know what i mean we yeah we up to the eyeballs in it i, I guess just another little thing is like so for those in the uk and a lot of countries like there is a lockdown but like a lockdown doesn't mean you're not allowed to leave the house like it's you know obviously you can go in your garden but or like you know those that walking dogs carry on walking your dogs if you don't have a dog like go for a walk like you can go out you can ride your bike you can exercise just stay away from other people like it's not it's not you're stuck in your house the whole time it's just you can't go near other people so don't don't yeah. don't spend e even if you are a big gamer and you're like ah oh, let me just play this game like force yourself to go out because after a few it's days of it you. you're going to start feeling really bad i promise I you that yeah honestly um exercise is great uh it boosts your your mentality ness i've just made up a word uh <laughs> it's just great it, it releases positive endorphins it's it's really good you feel yeah, that positive even dolphins wanna... you need those positive <laughs> dolphins. <laughs> dolphins not those, dolphins ne not those negative dolphins what a drag <laughs> they're like oh i'm bored of swimming like, get out of here you negative wait, dolphins i'm trying to do a dolphin how do you, how do you do like <laughs> <laughs> is it a granny dolphin you're like oh, oh come here dearie <laughs> <laughs> just imagine people right when when you're outside a, a giant big germs all right so 
If you see someone, just avoid them because the journey. Yeah, if actually attack them, attack them. Don't even, don't no, even take the charge. Don't avoid them. Advice. Charge them down, swinging fists, and just go. They're a giant germ. Get them! Get them! They're getting away! Get them! <laughs> charge them down with some. Yeah. Get those positive dolphins flowing. <laughs> Get them swimming. <laughs> Sp spray a bottle of uh, hand sanitizer. Just go and wipe them down. That's what you need to do. Something I've uh, been doing for uh, for exercise is uh, there's actually uh, a bunch of really good. Um, cause I've been getting into VR recently. There's a bunch of really good like VR exercise games. Stamp it. Don't play games. Go outside and exercise. Also, stamp it. Oh, you need to game too. Well, no, but like, <laughs> I mean, in England, you're only allowed out the house once, so like, you've got to have other yeah. things <laughs> as well. But like, VR is quite good anyway, because you are kind of tricking your brain to transport you to um to other places i've been playing a game called like box vr which is kind of like a boxing game where like Ooh, it's like that. Oh, it's so fun it's so well, fun it and it's like box VR, but it was a boxing vr yeah sense. but it's not like boxing against a person it's, it's almost like um like a tie hero or like beat saber or something so there's like kind of notes coming towards you and one will be, there'll be like hooks and uppercuts and like blocks and then like you've got to dodge left or like squat down and stuff so it's a proper good workout so i've been just blasting the air conditioning and and been doing that and it really does like <laughs> tie you out but it's really just fun as well like it's always yeah just, you know so so that's something that i know that's not something for for everyone for like those that don't have vr or I'll tell you what is a like massive it. workout doing um just dance oh my goodness yeah I that's another that round one. At my friend's house the other day and i was like right i'm gonna download it oh i did like three songs and i was like just sweating it was <laughs> I unbelievable. Know. It was ring crazy. fit adventure is another another good one uh, mm. for people on, on Nintendo. That's a, a fun game. Yeah, that's game. supposed to be pretty good, actually, isn't it? I've yeah, yeah, yeah. Good things about that. Um, but yeah, there's, if you don't want to spend money on gaming, there's loads of stuff as well to exercise. There's loads. Well, there's absolutely tons of home workouts as well. If you type in YouTube, like, home workouts for beginners, there's no exercise Yeah, but the thing is, need. there's there's some people, me included, like, I know you, like, you go to the gym and stuff, but, like, I, I, I just, I'm just going to get bored exercising. Like, I, I won't... Like, I'll do it for a bit and I'll get into it, but I won't keep it up. If it's a yeah. game and I'm just having fun, like, that's the only way I'm going to be... Like, I like sports. Like, you know, I like playing sports because it's just playing a game and I just happen hey, to be exercising. You really... You really... Whenever... The first time I met you and I saw you, uh, <laughs> you know, sat down on a desk type of way, I, the first thing that I thought was, you, you, man, that... That guy really likes sports. He's <laughs> he's he's. I the, like games. The sports image are just of sports. games. <laughs> I'm not like. I I'm, not, I'm not. saying say I'm an athlete. I like I'm not. Sports. I'm not going for a lot. I like playing sports. <laughs> <laughs> what sports? What sports? <laughs> well, I used what? to play. I used to play like uh, lots of basketball. I used to be basketball. I, I was on a squash team. I used to play badminton. Ha! 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 See? I, just, I don't think I've ever heard you come up with the phrase that I like sports. Uh, wait, so well, no, I'm saying like I don't like exercising for exercising, but I like playing games. And like, if you're playing sports, that just needs a to game. be on a t-shirt somewhere. Stamp along <laughs> this. I like, I like sports. I like sports. <laughs> I like sports. <laughs> uh, Brilliant. Oh, well, there you go, guys. There, they are the tips. The tips of self-isolation. And also, it's a great time to pick up a new hobby as well. Like, if you want to... I've just recently started to pick piano back up. Um, God, they're heavy is, as well. God. I know. That's, a good, that's another good way to exercise. Great pick exercise. up pianos. Unfortunately, they don't fall into the category of sports lifting pianos. But, mate, if, if they did, I'd get the t-shirt as well that I like sports. But <laughs> we, don't, we, don't, we don't do them. But, um, yeah, hobby. Get yourself knitting. Get yourself <laughs> knitting them socks for winter. You know, winter's coming. It's gonna be over. Winter, winter's going. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, one of the um, the other things is so so this plan from ages ago. Uh, I was gonna have like a, a games night uh, on Friday with just some mates. We always meet up and just play a bunch of like tabletop games and stuff. Uh, obviously, that's cancelled. Uh, but what we're gonna do is a uh, Jackbox, which is like a game oh, where you play it on so the good. TV. And so basically, we're gonna. Um, we're going to be playing it and then just live streaming it as like a private oh, yeah, live stream to join. them. Yeah, then they can just, but whether well, they can just play, it's not even like they don't even have to join as spectators. They're just normal players because if they can just see our screen, they can mm. play. So we're, we're going to have a, a remote games night and there's another game that they recommend recommended where it's like a, like a trivia game that you can like play online and stuff. So there are, 
Like if you Pop have a quiz. regular ac activity, there's a lot of ways you can kind of twist it. And it won't be the same. Like nothing's the same as like face-to-face -face interaction, but it's like better than nothing and it will stop you going mad. And what's this? I thought that was you. <laughs> Wait, you thought I was a llama? <laughs> no, look, there's someone carrying them on leads. Yeah, th these are the... So these are the like um, travelers that you get now. Have you not... Oh, yeah, because you did a live stream ages ago, and you were like, what's this? There's dolphins. <laughs> what's there's this? Turtles. What's this? There's llamas over there. What's this? <laughs> what's this? So what? So, okay, let's just talk about this for a second. So what What do you and don't you know about, like, the new updates? Have you, have you been to the Never? Have you seen anything? Do you uh, know about the Wandering Traders? No, I've not, I've not seen the new Never stuff. Like, so I haven't played Minecraft, like, regularly since before the Ocean update. So wow. I'm like proper. So the only bit I've been playing is so we've been doing Space Den, but that's on like it's basically like an adventure map. So it's all like yeah, you can't really get any ocean. You can't get any fish. Yeah, so it's, it's got some of the new like blocks that can be crafted and stuff, but it's not got any of the naturally generated stuff or anything. So yeah, I'm pretty like like I'm a Minecraft noob. It's cool because everyone's yeah. always like parents will tweet me saying like oh got to ask like the minecraft pro stand here i'm like oh, i don't know i mean blocks and stuff oh, I don't know. so these guys basically like wander um towards players and they offer uh, decent they, sometimes they offer decent deals but sometimes they just offer like a lot of crap to be honest so yeah a lot of people just kind of um like kill them and then take the leads because the leads are obviously quite a valuable resource so let's do that then <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Cheers, bro. <laughs> oh, you're getting spat on. Oh, the llamas are happy about. Oh no, they're right after each other. Well, they're spitting on each other. They're having, a, they're having a spat. A spit yeah, spat. Yeah, that's another thing you could do in isolation. You'd Stop a it. <laughs> <laughs> a spitting match with your friends. Oh, oh God. No, don't do mean, that, please. I don't, don't think do recommending that. spitting no, matches during a fight. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a two meter distance bad, but that, that's, that means you oh, can just impressive. spit each other. Impressive. Yeah, wow. Oh, so what have we got going on here then? For the people, if this is, this isn't going out to like people that can just listen, is it? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> like, I don't mean that. Okay, I don't mean you know what I mean. Like, there's not an there's not an audio only version. If right, that's, that's what, what I you mean. mean. People, people can, like, can listen. <laughs> no, I mean this will go out to people with ear squid. I mean, I don't <laughs> 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 uh, brilliant. All right. Yeah. Yeah, so, so have we, we missed anything from this world, then? Because I've seen a, le a lot of cool well, stuff. We had a well, nice We got a boat, but I don't know how to get in it. How do we get in the oh, boat? Yeah. Is that I one went... of my pirate ships that I made? Uh, probably. I think you built my it. my 2012 tutorial. <laughs> yeah. But I, I don't know. How, there's no way to get in it. Like, how do we? There's no ladder or anything. Is there not? Oh, well, maybe I we have to see. jump from here. What? You Onto think? the boat? Yeah. We just die. <laughs> Uh, do you think? Is it? Is it? Oh yeah, it's quite high, isn't it? It's pretty high. Okay, let's have a go. Oh yeah, there's no way you're making that. <laughs> no, if I punch you, you could make that. No, you make it on that end. See that end of that sail. Right, I'll run and jump. You stand there. Remember. Right, and I'll be punching. Yeah. Right. Qu quest right. rules. Okay. Ready. Uh, uh, uh. Oh. Perfect. I Perfect. thought I would have made that. Maybe there's a bit underneath we have to go in and have a look around. I couldn't. Oh, maybe. Or maybe right underneath. I, I circled like the outside. No, there's there's literally nothing. This is the worst pirate ship we've ever made. There's no way you can get on it. We we we'll, we'll add a, a ladder in now. <laughs> uh, what's you like? What's um, like when we uh we jumped in, Squid started like asking how I was and catching up and stuff. I was like, no, it's for the podcast. So uh, I'll be honest, it's been a while since I've like checked on your channel or kind of like seen what's going on with you so like is there anything oh, i've got three arms now mate three arms um 17 toes it's all happening with me um <laughs> no i don't know i've kind of got back into youtube a little bit um <laughs> like what are you playing an editor again okay um exciting times i'm playing arc so there's been a new arc dlc that's come out and it's kind of like a brand new game so i've just been kind of just smashing that out really is, it, is arc the dinosaur one Ark, that's it. Ark is the dinosaur one, mate. Yeah. Um, mm. So it's been it's been good actually. It's been good because sometimes obviously I don't want to bore everyone with that, but most of the time when they release like a new DLC out, it's kind of like a, just a different map and like one or two added dinosaurs. But this time they've kind of done it as it's like a simulation. So there's like four separate maps that you have to teleport between them using your little um, robot friend, um, and there's like 
five, six new dinosaurs. There's like a different bunch of game mechanics that you have to kind of watch out for now. Uh, so it's been pretty interesting. It's been like a, a breath of fresh air just for like people that aren't, haven't been playing Ark a lot. They can kind of jump into that because it's just new and completely different. So I've been, I've been doing a lot of episodes on it because I'm dedicated to finishing it because I had a lot of people, obviously, you know, on the channel saying, Squared, you got to finish this one. You never finish this one. So I'm like, right, okay, I'm going to actually do my best. I'm going to finish this game. And I'm going to laugh at everyone. Um, so, yeah, that's what, that's what I'm You're just, they want you to finish it because they want to... <laughs> it's not like, like a, ha, I showed you. I <laughs> did the thing you wanted me to do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. I know, I know. Um, yeah, Animal Crossing, I've been doing, like, summer videos on that. Um, so, I've been playing, like, just doing the important stuff. Obviously, if you've, if you've been playing on Animal Crossing, you'll know. But if you don't... You kind of do the same sort of thing. You you gather, you visit different islands, and then you kind of get these milestone things that happen like each and every day. So I've kind of just been recording that and all the fun stuff that's been happening. Like new people joining the island and obviously museums opening and, and whatnot. So yeah, that's they're the main two games that I've sort of been playing. I did kind of do a video on Minecraft when the Nether update came about because I just wanted to... I genuinely wanted just to see what it was all about and if it was if it was fun or not. And it's it's pretty good, to be honest. Like, I, what, what is it? What is the? Oh shit! I've, I, don't, I probably you probably shouldn't say. Cause probably everyone knows, don't they? I'm the only one who doesn't know. <laughs> so I'm maybe probably going to get it wrong because I've already I've already done like one video on it. But um, yeah, give me like book. a a three sentence summary. A three sentence summary. Well, it depends. It, it depends. It depends how long your paper is. Like that. That's sentence. one. Well, no. I said, well, no. That's a challenge <laughs> of how long can you make a sentence? Uh, how many you commas know, can you good, can you fit in I'm there? Not good with <laughs> that, mate. <laughs> It's a, so it's a new Nether update. There's four, I think there's four or f three or four new biomes in the Nether. There's a crimson forest. There's like a skeleton burn, desolate place. There's um, there's another sort of biome. Uh, there's new creatures. There's piglins, I think. Are they called hoglins? See, I don't even know. There's basically new creatures. There's new armor. You can get Netherite armor now, which is a, like better than diamond you get netherite tools so it's it's kind of cool that we've actually got something in the game that's better than diamond which is quite a big thing like ever since the game came out diamond has been the the best armor so it's quite yeah. a substantial update uh the good thing about it is that if you die in lava then your armor basically and your tools float you don't lose them uh so that's one sort of major thing about having the new sort of set of armor, as well as them, as well as them being like you know better, um, so that's quite cool. Um, what else? I kind of feel like I'm missing stuff. I don't think I am. Are there any new like it, uh, enemies? Well, yeah, you got the 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 piglins. I think they, I, I'm going to Google it now just because <laughs> I know there's going to be people listening going squid. They don't call piglins. Well, we don't need to spend too much time on it just because, like, I'm probably the only one here who doesn't know. Like, probably most people watching this already know. So I, I don't think wanna... the best thing about it is that you can actually go and live in the nether now because there's wood, there's trees, there's wood, there's food. Yeah. You know what I mean? You, you don't have, have they to, made like... it less like... Because um... one of the reasons why I didn't like building in the nether was the, 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 the mist that's everywhere. It was just, like really annoying and made you so you couldn't see very well, very far and it's just quite ugly yeah there's kind of like a haze i think that's just uh um, like a red like, well, no, like a tint a red xbox tint no, xbox no, no, no 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 i've played it <laughs> i've played minecraft on java as well like you know like, there was like it's kind of like a it's like a filter over everything it's kind of like yeah, you can no, i don't think yeah, i don't think there's that anymore no the, so there's a mist in one of the biomes it's like a really blue tint but yeah apart from that it's yeah, but you know, you said yeah. there, there's a ready tint in the never. Look, let's, let's go to the never. Look, what let me you show you. There's a ready tint. Follow me, look, I'll show you. Get off what Google. You... Stop Googling the <laughs> never. Look, follow me, look, there's one right here. You don't need to Google it, we just go there. I need food, you haven't For... supplied me. First hand. What do you mean, not get your own food? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not your right. mom, you know I don't what, Let me just explain to everyone what happened, right? So I joined the game in Stampy's bedroom, right? And he's like, uh, have you got any stuff? I'm like, no. And he's like, oh, well, uh, these are all my chests here, so you can bugger off. I'm like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so then I go in my room, right? Like, literal tumbleweeds across the floor. There's just a little bed at the end of the of the room with a squid flag. There's no chests. Doesn't supply me with any food or armor. Just just laughs at me, you know? I, I feel... 
pretty pretty sad. I haven't been taking care of stamps. <laughs> what is this? This is a scam. Oh wait, we've got a have we got a mine? Yeah. yeah. <gasps> we got a we got a chest room. Oh what what? We have a chest room in our basement. Oh, Did wait, is there any, anything good in there? <laughs> uh, chests. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> there's not a lot. No, there's just sandals and stuff in it. All right, looks like I'm going to have to stab. All right, let's go anyway. I ain't got no um, we go. I'll fine. just come out. Yeah, I just, I just pointed out that there's like, if you look in the distance, there's just a bit of a red haze. That's wait, not what are we sleeping for? To make it day. Well, we're going to the nether. I've just come back. You're too you slow. Been? Yeah, I left you trying to bread on everything. You didn't get it. What? Is there a red haze? Yeah, if you look in the distance, there's a red haze. <laughs> You've been in combat, I've just been trying. I love words like, we don't need to talk about the never too much, and it's just, <laughs> it's still talking about it. Wait, what? Let me have a look. <laughs> there's a bit of a, oh, okay, I'm coming back. There's a bit of a haze. It's a All bit right, of, it I'll be on. honest, when I went there, it wasn't as much of a haze as I remembered. <laughs> Maybe it is worse in console edition. Um, have you got like, tinted red glasses or something? But no, but I wish everything would be red. <laughs> <laughs> I don't just put on, put on my never glasses. Every time I go to the never, I just add glasses on. Look, look, look in the distance. See, like over there. What? Where? There's a red haze. No, there's not. There's a red haze. Look, even over like these close blocks here. Like if you if you could see a direct comparison, like to those like stony blocks compared to like on the overworld, you'd see yeah. like how how much difference there would be. Man, I don't see no red haze. I think you've got your anti-red haze glasses <laughs> on. Look There's down no there, look! Look, look, look how little definition you can see in those blocks. Like, see down there, like near that lava. That's because it's dark. That's not red. No, it's it is. Dark. It's like it's There's smooshy. No it's smooshy. Oh, God. Oh, great. Well, fabulous. Thank you. Uh, okay, yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> That was great. Oh, that my goodness. That was great. All right. have, you got your, have you got your brightness turned up to a full whack? This, yes, it's not. Why would it just switch you got when I went? Uh, turned down. <laughs> now I got it cracked up to the max. Oh my god! Right. Haze for so, days. <laughs> the Nether, right? So there's piglins, right? There's gold blocks in the Nether now. Did you know that? I don't, I don't, no. No. Okay. Good. Right. Uh, good. So I'm glad you didn't know that. It's a secret. There's, there's piglins that are watching. <laughs> They're half pig, half who knows what, says the wiki. Very interested in that. Ooh. Uh, so nice. that's great. There's also hoglins. Oh, I got them both right. So the hoglins are like little pigs, but they have tusks, and they can like smack you and knock, knock you back. And there's also three different biomes, the soul sand valleys, crimson forest, and the warped forest. Each of these comes with new blocks, plants, fungi, and items. Oh, fungi. <laughs> fungi. <laughs> 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 there you go. There's a summary of the never met. Lovely. No, oh, I need to wait. Let me just. I need to quickly like leave and rejoin. You sound like a robot. One second. Robot stamps is here. What was that? Discord. Yeah, everyone always says about how good Discord is, but it hello? constantly. Every, hello. No, you still sound like a robot. One minute. I'm, we might need to change the server. Yeah, Discord, like, everyone says, because I always use Skype, and Skype's pretty rubbish as well, and everyone said, oh, use Discord, but everyone always just sounds like a robot, like, you know, or every time we go to record, we always use Discord, and every time before we start, someone would go, like, they even sound like a robot, they sound like they're speaking in slow motion, and so it's yeah, so that's weird. what you sound like now. <laughs> oh, really? It's so weird. <laughs> right, one second, I'll ring you back. All right. I'm just going to keep talking because I don't want to have to edit out this gap. So, if I keep talking, then we can just leave all of this in. And Squid's going to call me back on Discord in a little bit of a moment. But, on the bright side, this gives us a chance to have a bit of a heart-to-heart. -heart, a one-on-one. -on -one, you chatting with old Mr. Stampy Cat. Alright, don't go on about it. Oh, hello, hello. Are you back? I'm back. I just said I want to carry on talking so I don't need to edit out the gap. <laughs> so <laughs> I just... You lazy bones. <laughs> what do you lazy. mean? I'm... All right, do you want to edit the whole thing? No, thanks. Exactly. I just <laughs> used to... So the way we used to edit it before is literally drag it into uh, Premiere Pro. Not endorsed, no sponsor. Um, and then I just used to have... We used to have tracks, like a jazz track. Are we still, is, is the jazz track still here? Yeah, look, I'll play one of the songs now. Listen, actually, no, don't do that because... 
I won't commit to that because I'm, I'm not going to listen back to this whole thing to get the timing right. So <laughs> there, there will be throughout this podcast, jazz tracks would have been played oh, periodically. Love smooth jazz. So, yeah, we used to have jazz in the background. We used to drag all them, chop at the beginning, chop at the end, bing, bang, bosh. Oh, it used to be amazing. But Stamps, I was used to, like, you know, you used to hate me for editing because I used to be so lazy. Oh, I used to be so... You didn't do any of the audio balancing or, or anything. <laughs> I used to dread the episodes that you would be editing. i go listen back to it, and it would be like, Hi, this is Stamping! And Squid would speak. and be like, Hi, I'm Squid as well. It's like, why, why are you so much more quiet than me? Like, just... <laughs> <laughs> oh, so what have dear. you been up to anyway what's what's new on on the miss mr longner's channel um yeah so i've been doing space den which has been really fun so i've been doing that with uh with squishy as uh, the main minecraft series that i've been doing uh and then yeah just trying to do a bunch of live streams like i'm kind of in the um uh the point now where it's like it's always been like doing youtube for fun it's always been like half hobby half work but like i've gradually as things have gone on just moved more and more to like hobby stuff like because there's a you always do a mixture you always want to be like you know you got to make a living got to pay the bills so you know you got to do stuff to make money but then like there's always just stuff that you do like this is just a cool thing i want to do like you'll spend ages making one video and you know it's never going to be worth it like the podcast like we don't have monetization on on this channel you're like we don't make you know we are the podcast what do you mean i thought we did i was I was relied on this for a new conservatory. <laughs> <I mean. laughs> like we don't have anything AdSense set up on like the magic animal. Like it's all just done. Like we like purely. It wasn't even for fun. I think we ended up we were paying for servers for the posting of it. So you know it's losing money, but it was fun. So we would just do it. And so now I'm like with my live streams uh, and, and and stuff. Like it's just just fun. So I'm just kind of like full focus into to that. Uh, I'm still not like uh, really wanting to to go back to to lovely world or anything yet. Uh, I still don't even know what I would do just because uh, Bedrock's just so laggy um, in my lovely world. So PC, PC, PC. Yeah, I, just, PC. I just don't enjoy. I just don't enjoy it. I, I, I'm that's, not a big Java. That's, that's I've me. never been a big Java fan, as you know, as you're always through the years twisted my arm to get me on Java. I feel like, so, like my life has been just trying to get you to play Minecraft on the Java edition. Yeah, I just don't really like. But I have been playing like. Um, just like gaming on the PC, like I, I probably game on the PC now more than the console because because um because I, I knew I was getting a VR headset, so I wanted to get a powerful PC to run it, and it's my first time having like a really powerful uh, PC. So now I've just been like, <gasps> there's been times when a game would be out on both, especially with Xbox Game Pass because all the Game Pass games are not on sponsored. PC or Xbox, um, <laughs> not sponsored. <laughs> so it'd be a case where it's like, oh yeah, this game's come out, I own it already, like essentially for free you know like or prepaid for it with a subscription so i'm like oh, i might as well play it on my pc because my pc is like five times as powerful as my my xbox so yeah. i might as well play it on here like, as long as it's a game that works well mouse and keyboard um so yeah did we uh, did can you remember did we have any like i swear we had a section of the podcast which was like something like tips yeah, oh, it's like, wasn't it? Yeah, like, like I know, uh, yeah, people would write, then I'd give, it was me, I'd, I'd have to give tips to people. Oh, we need to do that as well. I'll, I'll, yeah. While you're talking, I'll try to pick a tip out from two yeah. years ago. I think we, I ended up slowing it down a bit because I always felt like people would ask about things that I just don't know about. And I always feel like <laughs> I'll try and want to give some tip, but probably be giving really bad, it's, it's, it's bad good advice. To, good to yeah, make so, it up though. Because this is a bit of a, a special just one of podcasts, we haven't like, like got questions from people or anything just because you know normally we'd do these podcasts like weekly or or whatever and yeah yeah <laughs> we haven't yeah. asked anyone for questions and so uh don't like uh tweet this out either i kind of just want to upload this just randomly people are like what is this 2016 <laughs> or whenever the last one was when was the last tw- one two years ago 20 two years ago 20 like 17 i reckon this would just be yeah. nice for like what would be nice is because we can end this podcast and, and we can say two years well, no, well, then we can just say, right, we're not doing any more. Like, we don't plan to do any more. And then that would say, because the problem, I think, with the last podcast is we didn't announce we were stopping it. So <laughs> I think if we, if we end this one, we can, we can say it, and then we will hopefully get messaged less for people <laughs> saying, where's the next one? <laughs> so what have you been up to then? Because it's been two years. So, like, I know it's not been two years since you, we last did, like, a video together, but has there anything... Anything you want to talk about that's been exciting? Any funny stories? 
Oh, I, mean, it's, I mean, it'd be kind of sad if there was nothing, but it's kind of, <laughs> you know, when you just say like, what, what happened in the last two years? It's a bit, yeah, so, yeah. um, I had a really awkward one last week. So oh, we were on, having some, um, garden work do it. Like I'm having like, not like a pool in my backyard, but I'm having like a natural pool. So it's for like the dogs to swim in. Um, and like you can plant stuff up anyway. So we had a big, big, massive, um, like, jcb in the garden digging all the groundwork out and uh everything was going well and uh yeah i was just i was just there talking to my old boss and then this old man and his little grandson just like walked like down my drive into my gates and then just like stood there watching the diggers and i like turned to my boss and said um oh is do you know him and he was like no and then i was like well, I don't know him. And then, like, <laughs> I went over to this guy, and uh, he just said, oh, he, uh, this kid's probably about five or something. He's like, oh, yeah, he, uh, he just loves diggers. He absolutely loves them. <laughs> I'm like, okay. Um, That's not the way just... I thought. I thought this was going to be, like, a YouTube thing. I did not no, no, know no, it was no, going to no. go that way. And then, uh, <laughs> <laughs> and then he just kind of stood there. Like, imagine... If you just said that to someone and then he just kind of like took his eyes off me and then just ignored me and then went back to like watching the diggers and i'm like what right okay so i was like yeah yeah they're just doing some work blah 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 i got talking to him and anyway he he sort of thought i was working there as a worker because uh. i was like out in my scruffs and stuff and then uh i just said yeah well you know you can you can you can watch them and whatnot but um you know the, the, you, you probably need to move. It was there, anyway. It was there for about twenty minutes, <laughs> and I could not get him to leave. Like, and I just, I just didn't know what to say. That is <laughs> so good. Right like, actually, guy. in your drive as well, not even on the road. Like, no, like into my garden. Like he was <laughs> in my garden. Like your back garden. Yeah, my back garden. <laughs> and he just wouldn't leave. <laughs> and then, like, he was Who looking does, into like, my he house. Just wanders like, in. Like, looking at the dogs and pointing at them and i'm like go away (laughs) (laughs) and i just felt so bad because he was like he must have been about like 70 in his 70s and this kid was five so i'm like they're not doing any harm but i thought you know i kind of want to (laughs) like it's just odd isn't it oh god it was the weirdest thing ever uh, anyway, and they uh, the digger ended up hitting like a water pipe, and there was a big hoo ha about that. And I was fun and games, fun and games. So like my garden's now like half dug, and it looks like a quarry. And obviously, with everything going on, there's not going to be anybody here for another month. So I'm like, well, that's great, isn't it? I picked like the best time in the world to have work done. <laughs> you know what I mean? And Absolutely then how's clean. um? All, is all the stuff inside done? For those that don't know, you're getting like um. Yeah, so like there's a, a, there's a video on my stuff. channel um, where I did, like, a kitchen renovation video. So I thought it'd be pretty good to kind of, like, do a start to finish. Because often when you do projects in your house, you often kind of forget what it used to look like. You, you get used to the norm and, you know, you, you rarely sort of look back. So I thought, well, it'd be nice to do sort of like a, a full renovation video. So, uh, yeah, it's finished. Yeah, everything's done. Everything's fine. We had a little bit of problems with um, the storms. So we had like two storms back to back. We had like C- Sierra and we had Storm Dennis, and we ended up getting like a load of water in. Um, anyway, that got fixed. But yeah, everything's finished. So we are supposed to be doing more work this year to like the main part of the house. But yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> yeah, we we'll we'll see uh, how things done. go. Is there any yeah. like anything you were um you were going to go to like any events or any like travel plans that ended up getting cancelled? Um, well, one of the main ones that I, we were wanting to do was um, Florida for mine, um, the mine comp party. Oh, yeah. That was one, yeah. Of, one of the things that, like, you know, because me and Nicole wanted to go back to Florida because we went, um, last time we went was, like, 2016 for mine con. Went to, obviously, the one in Anaheim. And then we took a two-week holiday, first time in, like, America. And we was like, yeah, we definitely need to do this again. Uh, and then uh, it came up and I was like, it's perfect. It's like, you know, right time of year. And, uh, yeah, we were going to do that, but obviously it's got cancelled so <laughs> I, th- I think it's the same with everyone at the minute i think it's just like everyone's plans are kind of all up in the air so yeah. everyone's in the same boat the good thing about this thing happening at the minute is everyone's in it together you can often find like calmness 
in that fact you, you know that sort of feeling that everyone's going through the same thing like it's not you're not alone um, yeah yeah especially because it's like there's stuff like this all around the world but like it's very rarely like like everyone like it's glo- like there's you know every human in the world like there's there's it's rare that there's anything this global that affects you know there's you know you hear about there's you know there's been a bad you know storm in japan or you know there's been this major catastrophe but it always feels a bit distant just because it's like another country another culture and you and you never yeah, you're not experience there. any of the downside firsthand and you can sympathize and you can feel bad for the people that are but you're always separate but this is the one that's like oh no you see all the bad stuff that's happened in china and italy and like south korea and then it's like oh and now and us and like it's like it's all it's it's, it's universal yeah it's all real i think the thing as well when you see stuff on the news is because you're seeing it on tv um you, your mind kind of plays it as something that's happened but hasn't happened do you know what i mean like yeah it, well, it it's, it's real because i haven't like if i if, if i had like literally generally like not looked on social media not looked at the news if i went outside my house i would know no different like the, i haven't seen it you know it's not like and now yeah, the sky the has turned it's not like there was a red haze like the never <laughs> over everything or like fire from the sky like you can't see it like it's no. invisible but you just hear about it and it, you know i haven't you know luckily got firsthand i don't know anyone who's got the virus so like it could not be affecting me i just know that oh i need to change my life to stop it getting worse but like i can't see it so it is even though you know how bad it is because you can't see it 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 feels a bit odd compared to like when there's a storm that affects a bunch of people it's like oh yeah yeah, that was really loud last night like i i'm sure that's you know cut out power at places and people are struggling but like when it's this and it's so invisible like it, it it is odd yeah, I just think it's the the supermarkets are the thing that kind of strikes, like you know that that's where it kind of gets real. Yeah. Like when we went to um, Florida and there was Hurricane Matthew, it feels like that because when we went there, everyone was like buying torches and batteries and like you know like just all the shelves were empty, and it's kind of like that. But yeah, it's really weird. Like they stop pubs and, and clubs and stuff and you go to the supermarkets now and there's no there's no you know there's no booze <laughs> everyone's just bought oh, I, really? I don't understand like we went to Saints for yesterday that's everyone's like, the, priorities the beer and the wine section was empty and i'm like this country is boozy <laughs> you know what i mean but they're like there's no bread there's no flour um that's what you can kind of see in the supermarkets. But apart from that, like you said, there's there's not really much of a change. But and, and then and, and all of that is just people reacting to information as well. That's not like yeah, a, that's like almost like a secondhand reaction. You know, like it's you know they've they've said that it's just because people are obviously yeah. I mean that that's the so. crazy thing is like we're not running out of food. Like you can get no, you know you can still go short. You can still order food. It's like if everyone just didn't panic, it would just be fine. It's like we've mm-hmm. got enough food. Like just chill out. The thing is, it's gonna they're all gonna restock now because everyone's got so much food at home. They're gonna be eating it and then they can finally catch up. Like that is kind of <laughs> like everyone's crazy. either gonna come out of this like a lot fatter or a lot thinner because <laughs> 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 there's no McDonald's. There's no yeah kfc there's no well, the, starbucks the problem is is like like we have plenty of like we had like plenty of frozen food and stuff in anyway yeah. so like we, we we only bought like my the only thing we... anyway you you're like <laughs> a flower. You, you just like just point yourself at the sun for five minutes and you're topped up the, the the only thing we got like a lot more of than usual is um dog food just because alex has like a very particular dog food that doesn't make her belly go funny and it's like because it's such a specific one like we made sure yeah, we well, had that was one of, of that. people's arguments at the minute because obviously Nicole, um, she works at for pets at home, and um, yeah, a lot of people are like commenting on their like Facebook page and the Twitter saying, "Oh, you need to shut. It's not essential." And it's like, well, it is essential because at the minute supermarkets only stock one or two, you know, types of varieties of dog or cat food, and there's a yeah. lot of animals out there that have sensitive stomachs, sensitive diets. You know they need the they need the different stuff, so it it is yeah. essential stuff. Just because 
like, it's I, not affecting you we, we can eat animals. we can eat anything like i'll be like you know like i could eat i could eat the dog food if it came down to it like i'm gonna survive yeah. you know but like alex gets you know is really bad with like other types of dog food like we spent yeah, no, ages we're finding the the right one so that was the only thing i mean it's not like we bought we bought like they're like big bags but we just bought like two other like because they last ages they're huge bags yeah. so we, we got yeah, like, like we had like animals. half of one then we bought two so that was the only thing that we were like you know really really changed and then obviously we bought um 500 toilet rolls which is uh, the, uh, <laughs> what the government recommends. Toilet roll currency. <laughs> oh my goodness. We haven't actually bought any. The, we kind of like really weird, but you know, you can do the thing on Amazon where you kind of like buy something and then you can have it reoccurring sort of thing. So like every month we just buy like a bulk of toilet roll and keep them in storage. Yeah. So like we still got stuff from ages ago. So and not to brag or anything, like, don't come and ransack my house, you know what I mean? Yeah. Stay oh, you're gonna away. Lo- looters are going to show up in the morning now. No Why did you say that? <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, no, in all seriousness, I hope everyone does keep safe on the matter. Like, you know, follow what the, the government says, um, and uh, we'll try and provide a little bit of entertainment. <laughs> Hopefully this podcast provides a little bit of entertainment anyway. Yeah, I know everyone. this is like the, po- the, the podcast is like, like it's just us chatting but it, it was requested so much and like i kind of been thinking it might be nice to do a one-off and this just seemed like the uh the right time everything going on it's annoying because i really want to do like loads of streams just because there's loads of people at home with nothing to to do but it's just been so did you try stressful. twitch stressful yeah i did a couple of i did you don't like a... it so the the first stream went okay like it wasn't awful but it's like i hate the chat because it's just so many just giant emojis it's so bad for interaction because it's all just like giant emojis. Yeah, there's just a mo like it's just there's more like YouTube. There's hardly any emojis because it's just the normal like little ones. So Can't it's been. I swear you can like stop emotes. Or... Maybe, maybe, maybe. I didn't really, I didn't really look into it, but it was like, and I don't because people obviously like them. So it's like, but so and then <laughs> obviously, and then I found out that it's against YouTube's terms of service to do a video on YouTube, like um like linking to it which I didn't realize. So I'm sure, I think most people do it anyway, and I'm sure it would end yeah. up being fine. But there was that. And then also the the next time I went to stream, it was just really laggy on Twitch. And then oh, I switched yeah. over to YouTube and it was fine. So I wanted to make sure that it wasn't just my internet or whatever. Um, and so then- I'm sure that stuff can be sorted though. Like, you know, you've got a decent internet. Like I'm, I'm sure it's- Well, no, it wasn't the internet. Like that, that was the, the thing. And obviously I didn't change any settings in OBS. So all the bitrate settings, all of that was identical across both of them. So it wasn't even like- uh, anything along those lines are you so. a, are you an affiliate though no i'm not i swear that you only have a certain amount of bit rate if you're an affiliate yeah uh, if you're not an affiliate like it kind of like restricts your bandwidth but the, that's stu- I, I don't like that stuff either like why why give yeah. other why have these privileged people in that position i get it when it's getting to the point where it's like oh you have someone assigned to you and you have one-on-one interaction because there's a hard limit <laughs> to like how much they yeah, can yeah, do yeah. for that stuff. So I understand on on that stuff, but uh, like the fact that like when you become a Twitch partner, there's like stuff in the contract about you know you have to stream exclusively on Twitch and so yeah. So there was just a uh, there was just a few things that I wasn't a big fan of. But then I went back to YouTube straight after. Then I did a great stream and I didn't get any bots or anything. I was like, oh, this is good. And then the next stream there were bots, and then the stream after there weren't bots for like an hour have and a tried, half, like, and then they showed up. Stuff. Well, no, because it's not people's comments. Oh, no, it's, it's their it's their profiles, yeah. So it's not. Maybe you should like set up a Discord or something, and then like mute your chat, and then kind of link down below that you yeah. can chat. Yeah, I mean, so Discord. Squishy suggested that the problem is is most people are watching on their phones, and it's like, mm. are they gonna have like what the stream up? Like, can you even do that? Have Discord and the stream up on your phone? Like, how it's just such it's just such a worse viewing experience. Has no one got back to you about it. Uh, well, they, like, they acknowledged the problem and, like, the, <laughs> the person I speak to, I don't know if you're the same guy, um, like, he's passed it on to the team that deals with that stuff, so, yeah. but obviously, yeah, everyone's working at home from, from Google now, so I'm sure, you know, with everything going on, it's not going to get sped up, so it's just kind of like, um, it's just annoying, because now would be the perfect time, I was just getting into it, I got my new graphics done on the channel and stuff, and it's, like, it's all a bit, like, 
first world problems. And it's a hobby. Like, it's not like I don't rely on streaming for money. Like, it's, it's, yeah. I would be much, my time would be much better spent, you know, doing lovely world videos or Terraria videos, you know, like it's, but it's really fun. <laughs> so, yeah, and, that, and, and, and people want, it's great for like, it, I think it's better than videos for people in isolation because I, there is interaction. You can talk to each other in the chat. I can talk to you. It, I, I think it, it, well, that's the thing. You feel it, more connected better. that you're doing like a live stream. You can talk to people then and there. Yeah. It's a lot more raw, you know, and, and I think it comes across as well for the people that are, that you're interacting with. Like, I think it, they feel better because it's live. Yeah. You know? So, I don't know. Hope, I hope you get it sorted. I don't know. What, yeah, it's um, like at the moment, I'm just like, I'm going to carry on streaming just on YouTube and then just when the bot, like, I'm just going to always just be ready just to stop the stream. <laughs> That's the uh, the way I'm doing it. Because sometimes, you know, as I said, I can stream for an hour and a half and it will it will be fine. And then I think, I think, I think it's like, it's obviously automatic, the bots, because of how regular they are. But I think it needs to be someone at this botting company, whoever's doing it. They need to <laughs> click on the stream and set something up to do it. And so it's how quick are they checking to notice to, to do it. So I think that's what you can do. I think you can set your channel. Actually, no, that probably wouldn't work. I was going to say you can check, you can set your chat to like members only, but then again, you're kind of like restricting everyone else trying to view your videos. Yeah. And I don't have like, like a members thing set up anyway. So it's <clears throat> like people can't like, join or. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I don't I know, know what your big bean. Yeah. Oh, well, I'm, I'm sure you'll get it. So I bet don't worry, you know, just keep your head up, mate. You'll, you'll, You'll get there. Even yeah, that, it's, it's just, just especially just annoying at, to, uh... at this time. But you know, as I said, like it's ultimate. Like it's not like it's it's not that big of a like. I'm fine. Like um, like as I said, I'm super 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 lucky. Like we, we both are. The fact that it is affecting us, you know, so little directly. Like the biggest thing is that uh, obviously my sister's just given birth, and so they have a newborn, and they yeah. they're obviously having no visitors or whatever. So I've like I've seen her twice. <laughs> so like that's like the you know, and I'm super close with my family, and I haven't seen like my parents in a while and stuff. I'm staying clear of them. So it's that's the biggest thing is like the the social side of it, like just not seeing friends and family and that because yeah, you know, for a big but, gamer, we actually kind of like had a, I mean we didn't go out go out out much, but like we would see our friends and family there all the time. So that that's been the the biggest thing. <laughs> yeah well you know well everyone will get through it i mean th these rules are in place for a reason it's to stop the thing spreading more and hopefully to get the nhs under you know give it a bit of stress relief <laughs> yeah because obviously they're under major pressure at the minute and it's weird because i'm also seeing it from like that side because i have um two friends that actually work for the nhs one of them's a nurse so we like every day we talk to her and get updates and it's you know what i mean it's you can always it seems a lot more real when you've got someone you know who's yeah going to to help people um so we sent a uh well i didn't the course sent like i think like 90 95 cream eggs for everyone on the wall because <laughs> <laughs> they were all like really love cream eggs so she sent stuff there so i think i might do some more stuff like that to be honest in the future just to help yeah. them out like because it, there's other, the other, other things as well you can do for like um put up for 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 locally for saying that you'll do like dog walking for like people like mm. like for for elderly people that you know don't want to to leave the house or like to pick up their you know there's a lot of like very like like minor to you local stuff that you can do that could uh could really help people out as well yeah exactly and a lot of like other facebook groups and stuff like there's been a ah! oh my god <laughs> sorry i just got blown up <laughs> ah! there's been like it's a local been that long since a creeper i was like what <laughs> I know, I know. So we haven't oh, had to man. had to deal with in a, in a in a while. We should we should. I still want to try and get you roped into it. I know you're going to say no, but I still think one no. night we should we no. should do like a. I don't even know what you're going to say yet. But I'm saying a no. hardcore stream together, like on a on a just a normal world. See if we can. I don't know. Even if we can like, maybe raise some money or something. But, How many um, times have you died, already? <laughs> in this like easy um, world four times but that's why it's fun it wouldn't like, would last i'd only i'd only do it if it's yeah. agreed that like if we die and yeah. like the world's gone like we're done as well like we don't what one attempt <laughs> one because okay, that really two. raises the odds <laughs> okay but what about if like it's the first five minutes mm -hmm. yeah that's the, it would just be a why really short stream <laughs> <laughs> oh okay then all right yeah deal. that's 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 the only the only way i'd agree to and you can't be like oh no i've fallen into a hole and i'm dead now 
Oh, you saw you gotta, me coming. You knew my plan. You've got <laughs> you to give it a good go. Well, what would like, I, I feel like we should have a goal as well, then, if we're going to do that. What would be, like, our objective? Because if we just survive, is, though, we could just sit in a what, hole. What happens if one of us dies and one of us doesn't? Die? What, 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 what is the rules for hardcore? Would, does the thing get destroyed? No, no. It just the other person can't rejoin. I, th- I think we do, uh, we do solidarity rules then. <laughs> like, like if you die, I don't think I should just say "see you later" and then I just carry yeah. on. <laughs> we should do a for if do you, are you wanting to do it for charity or? Yeah, we can do. Yeah, all right. Let's do so. The let's do the first person. The first person that dies has to donate a thousand pounds to charity. Okay. Well, what what what, what charity? <laughs> just something to do with like helping the, with this thing that's going on at the minute. No, it okay. would be like the NHS or. But wait you know, a minute! Can we people. can't can we we can't like attack each no, we, other either. No, 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 we can't attack each other. And the goal I'll be is... like, I'll build the house. You go mining for the <laughs> diamond screen. <laughs> we're gonna be so. We're gonna be like not like trying to make it so the other one dies, but it's not directly because of them. Like the no, whole no, time, no. are we? No, okay, no, we can't do that. We can't. Do I that. will. <laughs> no, you can't do that because we'll have to be. So what's the goal then? The um, Ender Dragon. Oh, we won't get that far. I guess, I guess. I guess that would be a lofty goal for something to to work for. I think maybe something more, more, more manageable. <laughs> manageable, like what? Wait, what's it? What's it on though? Because I'm not. If it's on console, that's gonna be. Can we do it on this? Uh, well, yeah. Well, you can do it. If we're doing it on this, I do a console. Oh, you do it on fine, PC. All right, I'm happy that's how we're that. doing it now. Like Squid's playing on PC. I'm on uh, on console with the magic of crossplay. <laughs> Better together. <laughs> I see. I like it on this because, like, this is our preferred, our both our preferred platform. Which is well, nice. not really. I do. <laughs> I'm not. A... <laughs> you, do you even have a preferred platform? So every time I talk to you, like Xbox sucks it. Like, can't get better. What they tell you about Java? You're like, yeah, Java sucks. It's not complete. Well, no, I, I like I like the console edition. That's like. Which what? console edition? We're just like the console, the ones that are called console editions. So there's, so this is just called, this, this is Minecraft. The, yeah, this is just Minecraft. There's Minecraft so Java edition. Man. And then there's the console. So like Minecraft, like Xbox One edition, PlayStation 4 edition, you know, like they're all the, the console edition games. The ones that 4J yeah. made, like their game engine is my favorite game coming? engine. They're, so they're, they're working on Bedrock stuff. Uh, so there's no more updates? No, no more up. Not even for PS because they've added Bedrock to uh, PS4. I've not played it yet. Sucks. Yeah, I know. Yeah, so that was like my. I mean, that was the only version that I like. I really enjoyed. Like, it, I, I'm pretty sure if Minecraft was only the Java version or only like Bedrock, I probably wouldn't have got into it that much. So whose whose choice was that? Then? Was it Microsoft's just to close it down? Yeah, with well, the, the it, it got a bit conf- like I, they they want there to be just one version of Minecraft really, and they all work cross play and and stuff. So that's that's their their goal uh i guess but it's been like a like which i think is a fair enough goal but it's been a rocky journey to get there basically I, they released the i think my opinion is they released my correct opinion is that they released the <laughs> bedrock version too early like it wasn't like it was broken yeah, yeah. Like, like not even like oh this feature isn't here or i don't like this or it's laggy it's like no it just it breaks it crashes <laughs> like it <laughs> it's corrupted your work you know like it just didn't work you know so it was but i think they had a it was tied into like a Bit console a and stuff, so it was. Um, yeah. Fair enough. Anyway, back to this. We need a goal. So we, we do you want, do you want to just leave it up to everyone that listens to this. Like, when is this well, going out? I think it would be good or? to do um, something to do with like the the new never, because I've not really been into to that. Some way to so like something that we need to achieve, going to the the never. Like I don't really know. Despite your amazing uh, description <laughs> earlier, I don't really fully understand what is new. But is there like a difficult a item guide. to obtain <laughs> or something? I mean, even getting the Never portals a bit of a challenge and stuff. So maybe it's like stop uh, it. That's not a challenge. Come no, on, no, not to get down. to the like a challenge where we need to do something in the Never with all this. Well, we so it gives it. me a chance because it also just gives me a chance just to see all the new never stuff and everyone well, to we, be yeah, like, but we can include that. We can, we can be like, right, we need to get to this goal, but we have to do this, this and this first. You know what I mean? Like, we don't have to have the end goal to be in the nether, but we can ask people to set ourselves tasks that we need to do on the way. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. 
<laughs> I just didn't know if there was like one particularly difficult enemy or one very difficult item to get in the nether. Trying to get that could be a good, easy goal. You know, even yeah. if it's like, you know, I don't know, it's something to do with blaze powder or eye of enders. I don't know. I don't know. I don't I don't know. know. We'll do a bit <laughs> we'll do a bit of do a bit of the old research. Stick our re- heads in the old books. And yeah, see what's and, happening. and if it's for for like, I don't normally tweet out my live streams and stuff, but like, if it's for, if it's for charity, like you'll hear about it. If you follow us on uh, on Twitter, it's probably the best place to hear about it. And then we'll probably schedule it um, on a uh, on YouTube or however you're, however we're streaming. I mean, that's the only other thing when it's streamed is what if the bots show up and we've got to turn the chat off would be a bit of a bit of a pain. Yeah, especially be, if we're doing be. like, um, yeah, we also need to work out like the the charity because we, we, we you always got to do it like. Um, to donate like don't donate to us donate directly to, yeah, the, donate charity. to the charity so yeah, it's yeah. kind of um we yeah, we got some stuff to work out as we always did this in the podcast we'd come up with an idea and we'd spend ages working out in the podcast <laughs> rather than like <laughs> doing it afterwards but i don't know maybe it's fun for them to hear hear it yeah, from but the its thing origin is we haven't like you said we haven't really you know we where's last time we spoke like voice chat maybe like three weeks ago and like, we yeah. speak in in messenger but genuinely it's just for like a you doing what yeah. are you being playing and, and then when we do chat in person it's when we're playing something and we're just shouting at each yeah, other about whatever other, yeah. game we're playing like, he's behind you what are you doing <laughs> <laughs> that's usually what our conversations are oh wait are. one minute you have to keep talking i've got a package one sec he's got a package right everyone we're gonna play the game what's in squid's package everyone needs to, to make a prediction my guess is that he's got a delivery of Oh, what would he get a delivery of? I bet it's like uh, bin bags. That's my guess. It, it's uh, or some other kind of mundane household item. I, d- I don't feel like it's a tech delivery. It could it could be a cable, maybe a cable. But my my money is on he's just had a delivery of bin bags. So everyone, make your guess. Uh, you could write it in the comments down below, but then you could obviously very easily cheat and just <laughs> wait until we get the uh, the reveal. Uh, right. He's back. Time for the reveal of what was in Squid's package. All right, I'm back. Squid, what did you get? I don't know. He kind of <laughs> left it. I guess that's the rules nowadays, isn't it? Oh, you that not opened a... it? No, it's, it's a bit, I, think it's, I think it's just cat food, to be honest. Get get back down then. We're playing what's in Squid's package. It's, it's for Nicole. It's not for me. Oh, can you can you ask? Oh man, we do I had a whole Wait, bit. Wait one second then. Go okay. find it. Go find out. Go find out what it is. Find out what's oh. in Squid. <laughs> Nicole, I need to open your package to tell him in a podcast. <laughs> oh, poor Nicole. Poor Nicole having to <laughs> having to put up with this. <laughs> it's probably like a really private item. <laughs> what is it? What's in Squid's package? <laughs> Right, you... I've just shouted her. She I, said I... dog food and rabbit food. <laughs> dog food and rabbit food. Oh, my <laughs> she, guess... came out, she came out of the bedroom like, what? I'm like, Sam <laughs> doesn't know what's in the package of the podcast. She looks very confused. Uh, my guess was bin bags. Bin bags? In a in a box? Well, yeah, I, I feel like it's the type of thing that you could like easily run out of at the moment and be like, oh, we got all this other <laughs> yeah, stuff. Not, we didn't not, think not about bin food. bags. Bin bags. Bin bags. Bin bags. Yeah. I was wrong. Right. Everyone that's who what... guessed animal food, congratulations. You win. Squid, what did they win? Some kind of pub quiz here. Behind... <laughs> they, they win 10% of the dog food. Congratulations. I have to fight. You have to fight our dogs for it. Fight, yeah. <laughs> fight Cujo <laughs> for it. Yeah, you have to wrestle him for <laughs> I don't think you'll end up winning. <laughs> How are the uh, the doggers? Are you be um being able to like walk them all okay and that fine? Has it all been all right? Yeah, yeah, all right. It's 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 not bad. Um, we normally do them like separate because obviously because we've got three dogs. Like <laughs> sometimes it's a bit of a nightmare. Sometimes like you know you just get dragged along. So yeah, we're gonna take all three out today and see how see how they all get on because there's. You know, there seems to be a, a lot God. more dog walkers out there. How do you spend, like, uh, any time, like, doing anything else if you have to walk them all separately? Like, how does that work? Like, just, like, Nicole take... It's, it's, what, it's like... Just, yeah, well, yeah, no, she'll take, she'll take like, Kuja, and then I'll take Marley, and then we'll, like, both take Lily together. Okay. 
<laughs> I feel like yeah, that, no, that I feel like that makes up like the majority of a day. Hi, love. I've just been out for like an hour and a half. I'm gonna check the other dog out for another hour. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's what I'm. That's nah. what I feel like it would be like. That's like, like one after another. Yeah. No. To be honest, like Kuja, he gets tired pretty easily, and when yeah. he gets tired, he just lays down, and like you know when he doesn't want to do something because he just he just won't do it. So. It's, yeah. it's annoying sometimes because sometimes you'll be out on a walk and you'll just be like, no, I'm going to lay here. <laughs> it's like, okay. <laughs> not, not the best time right now, Cooja. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, there was that time. Oh, we went to like Costa with him and we were sat outside having a coffee and uh, we were like, right, let's go. And he just wouldn't get up and he just wouldn't get up. We were there for like 20 minutes and he finally got up. And these two little old ladies walked in, like, just around the corner into the shop. And they, they were like, oh, it's just a bed. And then they started, like, cuddling him and rubbing him. And then he laid down. And I'm like, no, <laughs> 20 minutes to get him up. And then we finally got him up again. And then he, like, laid down in the disabled spot of the car park. And we just couldn't get him to move. We just couldn't get him to move. Oh, it was the worst. But oh, boy. That was he's a, a, he's a big boy. Like, you got to imagine him... Imagine if you were that size and you were to walk around all day. I know he's got four yeah. legs. <laughs> I know. It's like today, like we've had some nice weather, but he gets quite tired. Um, but he did all right. When we went to Scotland t- uh, with him, he was... he was. And that, that's a was, long walk as well. Great. How long does it take to walk to Scotland? Oh, at least three days. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he was fine there. Skip the whole way. Egg. We rode him there. Like, go on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, he was, he's all right. He's, but he's like 10 and a half stone, so he's he's a pretty heavy dog. Yeah, I mean, that's not as heavy like as I thought. That's six like. Six wet through, don't you? Pardon? You only wear like six wet through, don't you? Only wear what? You only wear six stone oh. wet through, don't you? Yeah. No? You're not going <laughs> it? <laughs> <laughs> no, I know what you're saying. Like, you I'm like, eat much. no, because I, 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 I'm, I'm like, I'm like nine stone something. I thought you were saying I only wear, <laughs> but it's, it's your accent. Say, 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 way. Where? You say where? I say where. You said where. You said where. where. You said where. Uh, you go where? You, you only wear. Brian. You only wear <laughs> six stone. How long have you known? You, you only wear. Problem understanding me ages ago. What? I said you ah! hey! <laughs> oh, he's back! There was another one! Oh, it's his friend. Get my leads. Get my leads. Are you going to get spat get my, at? Get my leads. Oh, not this. Get my leads. Spit, yeah, spit on him. Get my leads. Yeah, go on. Spit oh, no, on this, are they spitting me now? Yeah, they, they, go on, spit him. Why, why, are, they, why are they I'll so smiley him. while they spit? Oh, they're giving up. <laughs> it's not worth the effort. Not worth the effort. Yeah, go on. I'll spit on him. <laughs> Wait, stop, stop don't encourage stop them. Stop okay, out of it. It's gross. Disgusting I'm gonna place. Llamas. I'm going to get some lambs in our house. <laughs> Did you take the leads? Uh, I think so. Do you want them? Yeah, we need, well, I need to get these lambs in the house. They're going to they're gonna roam wild. I keep dropping my pickaxe. So I've been playing Ark, and all the buttons that I've learned to play Ark are just messing me up. Like, I keep running instead of crouching, and I keep dropping my pickaxe instead of inventory. It's very so annoying. One of the things that always annoys me about about bedrock is like if you go through the menus too quick it just doesn't register so like the main thing that like messes me up is i'll go to like be moving around my inventory and if you press yeah so if i press to like move to an item and then press Hmm. to like quick move it or something it doesn't register if i do it too fast and so then i'll go to move one thing and then go to switch to the next thing but i won't have moved the first thing and it'll mess the whole ordeal up and they'll be like oh what's going on you know like you know in one small mistake when you're trying to do things quickly and it just like spreads across oh, and it it makes me mad <laughs> this is stump stump is rambling oh, oh. anyway um let me have a look on the last podcast to see if we have any tips. Because it's going to be all like, "Where's the podcast?" Section. It probably is. Doing. Where's the podcast? Uh, top comments. Oh, okay. what, what, what's uh, the guy? What, what are the top comments? What? Oh my goodness! Someone got nine. Oh. Uh, it's just someone moaning about us saying we've changed. Yeah. Do you want to hear it? Go on then. Uh, this is from Froggy Bunny. Okay. 
Mr. Stampy and Mr. Squiddy, oh, I feel like your channels have changed a little too much. Your channels were used to be two of you being friends in an adventure map or in a series, but everything's changed. I know rarely, I know rarely see you, but what the... Okay, so this isn't me reading funny, this is just grammatical errors. I know rarely see you both together. <laughs> uh, now that building time and quest is done... I don't see adventure maps anymore. I guess the world is changing, so I can't see it say anything. But please, I want to see you both play together again. I know no one will read this, but if you do, <laughs> please do my request. Bring back Squid and Stampy. That's my favourite part, <laughs> is I know no one will read I mean, that's a fair enough comment. Like, it's, it's like, it's true. Like, one of the things that kind of, like, um, kind of annoys me is, is when, like, people talk about, like, saying, like, oh, you've changed, or, like, I want the old Stampy or the old Squid. But like more often than not, it's like it's they have changed, but they don't realize it. Like yeah. what what they're nostalgic for is less the way we were and more like that time when, in their life. Yeah. Like when they yeah. were, you know, either when they were younger or when like you were first discovered, like I'm nostalgic to when I first played Minecraft. Not because Minecraft was better then. It's just because it was so new and fresh. And I'm like, I look back fondly at that time of my life and people want like that's why people have nostalgia is that it reminds them of those times and so it's it's less like like we haven't changed like i know we're not doing those same like those same types of videos as much and you mm. know we're not doing youtube as much but as people like we're the same people like we yeah. i promise you we, we haven't changed but nah, yeah. like you you have and like not less you have but like the position you're in in your life has has changed and that's like the 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 bigger thing you've grown up haven't you sausage yes you have <laughs> yeah happy birthday happy birthday happy birthday um, sausage <laughs> <laughs> why is there no tips did we not ask for any tips i don't think we were asked for any tips uh maybe, uh, maybe go through like uh go through some of the older ones yeah the top comments are probably all going to be more more like that stuff oh i like our intro music that was quite jazzy that wasn't it <laughs> uh, no no tips oh squiddy tips how do i teach my trainer the hm that was it squid you would get given a stupid tip you would get given like a like a ridiculous one and you get a serious and one. it would be like how do i turn my unicorn into a flapjack or something <laughs> and then i would get a proper get a really one that's what one, we yeah. used to do <laughs> Oh my goodness. I remember. That is all now. coming back now. Yes. You've changed, Stamps. Yes. You've changed. <laughs> <laughs> I prefer the old right, yeah, there's, yeah, I can't find any tips. Anyway, if if we do do um, another one of these, <laughs> then. Do do. Idiot. <laughs> yeah, do do. I do like do. sports. Come on, he's a do. Um, <laughs> I like sports. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, leave some tips down below. But we might have to end this here because I really need a wee. And, you know, because I've, I've changed so much, I'm getting older. My bladder's got a little bit smaller and I've been holding a, a it's wee. It's shriveled. Wee. It's shriveled in your old age. I don't... <laughs> oh, dear. Yes, it's shriveled. Um, so, yeah. Right. So, let's end this podcast by saying... Plan? So, there is no plans to do more of these podcasts, which isn't saying they're never going to show up, but... People We've asking still got a lot more to talk about. Yeah, yeah. So I'm not saying like we might do more, but I'm saying people asking for more will not affect whether there are more. Is the, is the way I'm putting this out there? Okay. <laughs> well, I, th I think if they haven't gotten that message from the past two <laughs> years of no podcast, yeah, I don't okay. think they're ever gonna get it started. <laughs> oh, I mean, it's even such a minor thing, but it is gets like like so much of our lives is people asking for things that we're we're not doing, and it like it, like it actively turns me off from wanting to, to do those things. And like you just get like you end up resenting yeah. the thing because it's all about so much. So the, it, it seems like there, there's I mean this was quite fun, so it seems like there's a good chance more of these will uh, will show up. <laughs> um, Stamps was just seeing if this was going to be boring or not. He's like, yeah, well, it's turned you passed, Squid. Fun, so, uh, well done. Yeah, I'll see you next week, mate. Then, yeah, all right. <laughs> well, if we jumped in here, we just couldn't find anything to talk about. Well, I don't know. Like this, I, mean, I, I, I enjoyed this. I would be happy anything. to do this again. So it might, it might show up. Just stay, stay tuned. Uh, the the live stream we spoke I just about really the hard. I want to see you die and donate some money to charity. That's yeah. just kind of. What's going on. <laughs> the the hardcore live stream will will show up, and we'll stream that if we're doing it for charity. Uh, we'll do it on our main channels, I assume, because we want as many people uh, here oh, as yeah. possible rather than doing it on here. So, uh, yeah. yeah. 
uh, stay tuned on that there. And uh, I just want to make sure that I really keep talking for as long as possible because Squid needs, uh, needs a right, wee well, wee. So, well, if uh, you want to keep talking, I can wee and come back. And <laughs> that's all right. We're, we'll end it here. It's a good point to, to end it. the microphone into the toilet? <laughs> no. We'll play the next, the next game. Free. How long right. will Squid's wee right. be? Will he wee for five <laughs> seconds or will it be four? Okay, right. That's the end of this podcast. I can't remember how we used to end these. I can probably fill a couple of them, to be honest. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Enough detail, Squid. Right, say goodbye, Squid, and then we'll go. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in. It's been a fun hour. Hopefully, you've enjoyed it while you've been, you know, hoovering or dusting. <laughs> no one was hoovering while watching Dusting this. them little, nice little things on your mantelpiece or... Maybe out walking the dog or riding the bike or maybe doing sports. Were you having you know, a tidy I'm... up, Sausage? Were you having a tidy up? Can we always, can we call our viewers Sausage from now on? Can right. we just, oh, sausage. hello, Sausage. Man, I think they'd like that. Would you like to be called Sausage? I think you do. It's quite endearing. It's like a right, YouTube sausage. channel when they, um, they've got like a name and they call it like, yeah. I'm Ryan. Oh, you guys are my Ryanators. You, you guys are <laughs> Sausages. Okay, yeah, that's what it is. Welcome to the, the sausage, sausage army. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Subscribe to the sausage army. The sausage army. Uh, Assemble. Uh, 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 uh. Right. Thanks for watching, sausages, and we'll see you <laughs> in the next one. <laughs> Bye. Bye.